What? It's top Tobo and there haven't been any top fives or top tens or even theories for that matter? How about we fix that with this? What's going on everyone? My name is Michael Oshawata Stuff bringing you guys a new video. And today we're going to be looking at Pokemon. Particularly some pretty fun ones. So as we all know Pokemon have had some pretty interesting, be cutesy, and even badass designs. There are even some moments in the anime that are super kawaii. But I'm going to be looking at the top five Duppiest, I hope I spelled that right, Duppiest Pokemon ever. Keep in mind, this is only my opinion, so don't be upset even if you are wrong. And without further ado, let's get into it. Before we do though, I would appreciate if anyone watching this video would potentially do the Oshawaddle on the like and subscribe buttons, and maybe leave a comment of what I have done right and what I can do better on in the comments down below. Without further ado, let's get into it, starting with our honorable mentions of Weezing, Psyduck, and Slowpoke. If those aren't enough to make you think these are pretty doppy Pokemon, I don't know what is. This is... This is something. Starting off at number 5, we have Wooper and Quagsile. I picked Wooper and Quagsile just because they have some pretty funny moments in the anime. Like, there's this moment... I couldn't find anything for it, but there's this moment of Wooper, and he's just eating a mushroom, and he turns around, and he's like, Can I help you? It's basically what it's like. He's so savage, too. And just... Look at those eyes and those little mouth, and he doesn't even have hands, and he's able to use Ice Punch. How? So for that, I feel like these the reason these two are so doppy is because it starts off not having a nose and having really big eyes to evolving to have a nose and super tiny eyes. Start, coming in at number four, we have my man, Paloswine. Now, I know, I know, I know Paloswine doesn't look all that doppy to you guys, but when I show you this photo, you'll see Paloswine in a whole new light. I kid you not, that little dot right there is its eye. I did not edit this. Well, I did, but not this photo particularly. That is its eye. This thing is so doppy, it has to have Jinx help it see. Coming in at number three. Oh... Oh my goodness, I'm, I can't help myself. I'm about to giggle already. We have Sfeel. <laughs> now, some people are probably not going to be able to like see why I picked this as a, such a doppy Pokemon. Allow this to help. Look at... if. How does that make you feel? <laughs> this thing's pretty doppy after all, and it has several other moments like this in the anime. And overall, it even gets evolves into this, and it gets still a very nice mustache. So, with all those reasons, I feel Sfeel is the perfect fit for number three. Coming in at number four, I mean number two, we have Stunfisk. I pick Stunfisk because... He's Stunfisk. He can fly, he can swim, he can apparently somehow manage to walk. I don't know how, I guess he bounces up and down. And overall, I really just enjoy him. Every time I see that face, I giggle to myself. Oh, uh, and it just, it cracks me up. And coming in at number one, we have Mudkip. Now, I know a lot of people are probably going to say, Mudkip's not Dobby, this is a cop-out. Boo! But... If you hear me out, this thing is pretty doppy. Look at these drawings. Are you seeing those drawings? Those that those eyes and that mouth and even I didn't know this, but it has a nose, guys. This thing just looks so doppy to me and it's adorable. I guess another feature could be because of the new Pokemon fusion thing. Well it's not necessarily new, but like God darn it. I can totally see each and every one of these actually being a Pokemon. Who knows, maybe we'll get a Pokemon Mudkip version. And we can have all these be Pokemon. Also, I have bought a uh, person who's been incredibly awesome in the Oshawata stuff family. And he just leaves comments everywhere. I'm going to have to do a reading your comments bot version if he keeps it up. So, for all those reasons... Oh, fun fact. I've actually got comments by HDV. So now I've been... no um. So now I just need to be noticed by Mokaplio and M MatPat. Senpai notice me. And I will sleep and die happy. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It was a bit weird. Haven't really done a top 5 or 10 in forever. I kind of like the idea of doing it as like a monthly theme though. And 
Yeah, if you did, don't forget to do the Oshawaddle, and I will see all of you guys in the next video. Peace out.